hogs on the mob planting purple seeds. Baltimore Ravens coat, purple trim, big body old school for low. Purple rim, seven seven cutty, black with the purple All right, strip. Ravens fam, it's real. <laughs> For those of you seeing my short, I, I didn't want to believe it because that's just not really the Ravens' way to get someone this young still in their prime. We're going to speak about offense. We're going to speak about that. I know some of y'all, oh, he should have got, a, he should have got an offensive player. The day is not over yet. Is it? Is it Tuesday? No. We still have time. So, Usa. Now, Laquan Smith is a Baltimore Raven. And as I'm making this, somebody subscribe. So, thank you for the subscription, Donnie, y'all. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Now, Laquan Smith is a Baltimore Raven. That sounds weird. I remember reading articles about how this is not going to happen. I remember say, trying to say, man, we're going to get him. We're going to. It's not going to happen. I remember multiple Raven Flock members said, we need this guy. So many people downplayed it. You're not going to get him. You're not going to get him. Well, we got him. And I believe it was only for a second in the famous. Famous Eric DaCosta pick a fifth. And that's not bad. I see some people saying, Oh, you just gonna re he's just for rent. He's just for rent. He's gonna be a Raven for a long time. They're gonna figure out some way to get him and sign fully guaranteed Lamar action. Jackson. It's going to happen. It's going to happen. Now, let's look at what this man from Georgia, and Georgia been killing it. Georgia, well, Tennessee right now. I think they still killing it. But Georgia, 2018 pick. Man, it's going to, it's fire. Okay, so let's just look at it. Solo, 52. That's third. Look at that. Let, let me make sure y'all see that my little mouse going around. That's third. 2.5 sacks. I think that's going to even go higher. Just, ooh, and when I saw that, it was real. Oh, I'm, I'm, I'm t hold on, hold on. Let, let, let me make the screen big again. When I saw that, the first thing in my head was, it was two things, really. Grandpa Barnes is gone. Well, he's going to be on back burner. Which I'm like, it's grandpa. But him, Raquan Smith, and Patrick Queen. That is a, that can be, this right here. The Ravens work it out some way. We could have the making of a Patrick Willis and a Navarro Bowman for the, the, Sport fans, they know that dynamic duo that Frisco had back in the day when we played them in the Super Bowl. The Patrick Willis and Navarro Bowman was special. And this right here could be something very special. Because I know we're calling Stan. We're going to see about Patrick, Patrick Queen. We're going to see. But, yeah. Yeah, just <laughs> Oh my god, that was that was my face. Cause my wife was talking, I said She told my what what? I said, I think we just got Raquan Smith. She told me, uh uh. It was like I didn't even believe it. I didn't believe I didn't believe it, y'all. I don't believe it. But anyway. That sex, I believe it's going to go higher because PQ is getting sex. This man can get sex too. Okay. That forced fumble, I think he's going to update that with the Ravens. Interception, he has two. Not bad. And, we, and he's a sure tackler because I was looking at, shout out to Sip to Tally. 
he did a quick stream. I caught the end of it, so I had to rewind it because I had to go get my son. But that man didn't miss a tackle. And he said that in his video. He didn't miss a tackle for us that game. And I was sitting there looking like he's a sure bird hug tackler. And we know we need that. But let's continue looking at the stats. So 2018 have a total of 122. Five sacks. Mm -mm -mm. I can't believe we got this man. And he was drafted real early too. He was drafted real early. 2019, 101. 2020, 139. It's going up. It's going like the Jeffersons, baby. It's going like the Jeffersons. 163 last year. Mm. 163. This year, he has 83 so far. We ain't even close to being done. We ain't close to being done. And he can actually break his sack record from what he had last year, this year. But the man is just... Look at them stats. The man is special. The man is special. He covered the holes good. He's just very smart. It's going to be awesome. It's going to be awesome. Just to see him and PQ do their thing. And I believe the Ravens. Let's see. Let's see. I think that's a Is that a Monday? I think that's a Monday. I know we play New Orleans. I think that's a Monday. Why that's loading, taking so long? Because that VBN be blocking that stuff. I believe that is a Monday. Monday Night Football, I believe. Let's see. Yeah, Monday Night Football. So he's going to be, he can be playing in New Orleans. Then we get the bye week. Then we go on from there. So it's going to be great. It's going to be great. And I think, did y'all already kill New Orleans this year? As a matter of fact, hold on. Hold on. Bear with me, y'all. I think he already massacred New Orleans already. I think he already did. Let's see. Let's see. Let me. Let me. Let me. Let me. Let me. Let me pull this up. Okay. I think he already massacred New Orleans. Let me go to this year. Hopefully they show me the breakdown of this stats because I think did the Bears play New Orleans? I think they did. Let's see. Let's see real quick. No, okay, they did. Don't. I was gonna look it up. Okay, he go, he whoop any down twice. <laughs> but uh, yeah, yeah, you know he uh, <sighs> you seen that video where uh, was it Robert Quinn? He was hurt by the uh Robert Quinn leaving, and I think that was the Bears' um strategy. Really, is just to slowly, you know. Get get uh get other people, get other people in that, get other players in that, and let's see, and let's see his game with the cowgirls yesterday. Let's see what he did. Defense. So he had five total tackles. Yeah, five total tackles yesterday. That's not bad. That's not bad. Playing against them cowgirls. That's not bad. You know, the offense is a stinker. They be having their defense all out there so, so much. But they're a growing team. But, uh, yeah. Yeah, so y'all tell me what y'all think about this. Obviously, I love it. I don't think it's over. Now, as far as the, the offense, I think Eric, hopefully Eric DaCosta can make a move. I know a lot of people saying DJ Moore. I know some people are saying Brandon Cooks. We're going to see. I would love for DJ Moore, but uh, some of the rumors are is that uh, the uh, Panthers, they're asking a lot for him, which he's a dog, but he's miserable out there. And to me, I know they're rebuilding, but they're not going a fully tank way. Um, but yeah, just free to me. I heard DeCosta can pull something out of his head and get him to Man, I, I might lose my mind.
I might go. I might go my, with one of my favorite rappers, DMX. I might lose my mind up in here. Up in here. But we're going to see. It's not over yet, y'all. So hit the like, hit the subscribe, hit the share. Everybody stay safe. God bless. Quan Smith is a raven, baby.